tonight, there's been a break in the case of a crash that killed an FDLE agent. And the driver turning himself in just days after that special agent died from his injuries. Local 10 crime specialist Bridget Matter reports now from West Miami Dade. An arrest has been made weeks after the crash. Police say the driver that hit the FDLE agent was under the influence. It's been a tough few weeks for law enforcement here in our community with two line of duty deaths. Special Agent Jose Perez dedicated his life to service. He served in the U.S. military before spending more than 30 years in law enforcement. He retired assistant chief with the city of Miami police. On August 2nd, while working as an agent for the Florida Department of Law Enforcement, he was involved in a crash. The 55-year-old was in an unmarked FDLE car when he was hit by a pickup truck. He was taken to the hospital with serious injuries, collapsed lungs, a fractured sternum, and brain bleed. He died 17 days later. Sky 10 flew over a procession for Perez as he was escorted from Kendall Regional Hospital to the medical examiner's office. Police arrested the driver, 35-year-old Yasmael Sandoval. Investigators say a toxicology report detected alcohol, cocaine, and marijuana in his system. Police say they found beer bottles on the floor of Sandoval's car. He's facing DUI and vehicular homicide charges. In 2008, Sandoval was convicted of a DUI. We did visit Perez's home, but family declined to speak. A funeral is expected to take place August 29th. In Southwest Miami-Dade, Bridget Matter, Local 10 News.